J'ai du wow 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 J'ai du wow 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 J'ai du wow 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 J'ai du wow 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 Hey, this is Chris, and welcome to Sincere Systems Review Day 4. Now, Day 4 and Day 3 I've swapped around um, because if, what I wanted to do is to work out how to fund the system using Bitcoin, both from a hard wallet and from an exchange. Um, I did this one first, and things went a little wrong, and you'll find out why later on. So what I've done is I've put the Bitcoin funding from a Bitcoin wallet first so that's day three and I've divided that into two parts to make it uh, easier to consume um, and this is day four which is going to be what not to do in my view now you are allowed to fund Bitcoin into sincere systems from a Bitcoin exchange the trouble is it's really really complicated as you will soon see so I'm not saying don't do it but I think if you do do it you've got to really be on the ball uh, before you <laughs> before you actually attempt to fund across Another thing you'll notice is there's a little bit of chopping as the video goes on. Uh, what I've done is I've edited it to kind of shorten the amount of time that it takes to go through um, what I went through. Um, it should all still make sense, but uh, wait until the end because we did sort things out. By we, I mean myself, support team from Sincere Systems, uh, plus my sponsor Drew. We all got together and in the end everything worked out nicely. So uh, hang on to the end just, uh, just so you can see how to do it if it happens to you. Anyway, without further ado, I'll hand you over to the video. Hi there, this is Chris and welcome to video number four of my Sincere Systems review. Today is funding day and uh, probably remember that we did a $100 test and we've been earning a um, little, yeah, little bit of money, a few cents here and there, but just to get the feel of the system. And I would advise that you do the same. Just put a small amount of money in, test it, get the feel of it, see um, see how you feel about it. And if you're confident that it's going to work for you, then um, fund more, obviously. Um, so what we're going to do today is we're going to go into the system and fund with Bitcoin. And we're going to fund in one of three ways. So we're going to start off with Kraken today, see how long that takes. We're going to go on to the, um, to the Bitcoin wallet, the hard wallet, see how long that takes. Uh, and then finally, we will do perfect money and see how long that takes. Now, what I'm hoping to uh, achieve is a funding of round about somewhere between $3,000 and $5,000. may seem a lot to a lot of people, but um, uh, a little bit later on, I'll show you a calculator, uh, which I tell you what, when you see the calculator, I think you'll want to fund more as well. But uh, we'll get on to that on a later video. So here we are, finance page. And you'll probably recall from my day one video, if you've had a look at that, uh, that down at the bottom section, uh, you get a report of all of your trades. Um, and the 4th of November, uh, which is today, um, has already come in at 0.39%. And you can see over here that that has earned me 20 cents today um, because we're on the 50-50 split and they round it up in your favor. So that's nice. So we're going to concentrate over on the uh, left hand side of the screen uh, today and we're going to just go to the replenish tab. As you come down, it's got amount. So in other words, what we're going to do here is we're going to put the amount of USD that we wish to invest here. Um, but we're going to actually use cryptocurrency. Um, we could, if we put the down tab, go perfect money cryptocurrency, but we're going to go cryptocurrency and we're going to fund it with Kraken. So let me just put in here the amount that I am going to invest. And I am going to invest $1,500. Now that may seem a lot to a lot of people, but if we come back to the dashboard page, and slide down to investments, you'll be able to see why um, I'm going to fund 1,500. Um, if we hover over here, you see at the moment we're at $100, that's a 50-50 split. If we go up to $500, that's a 60-40 split. We keep 60% of the profits. And it just goes up another 5%, so 65-35, if we hit $1,000. $500. Obviously, it's an aim to get to 5000 because that's a 70-30 split. And when I showed the calculator on a subsequent video, you will see how important this little section here is. 
Okay, let's go back to the cryptocurrency. So 1,500. And all we do here is click add funds. Just make sure that it says total amount 1,500 in this little blue box. And we're going to add funds. So this little box comes up and it's Sincere Systems Inc. 1,500 US dollars. Um, they give you an order number. This is my order number. And how would you like to pay? I'm going to go for Bitcoin and I'm going to click continue. Okay, so we've uh, got, if you look at the bottom here, we have 30, just under 30 minutes to complete this payment. Um, we are going to fund 1,500 US dollars. And at the moment that is point um, sorry, point one zero eight seven six five nine seven Bitcoin. And I'm going to bring up a little notepad and I'm going to paste that amount in the notepad. What I also want to do is to uh, pay to this address. And this address, of course, is either the QR code, which we can scan, or of course, we can copy and paste this Bitcoin address here. So we copy, I'm going to bring up my notepad and I'm going to paste the address in there too. Okay, so we've got the amount we want to pay and we've got the address we want to pay it. So 27 minutes left to pay. Let's head over to Kraken. I'm already logged in. Now, if I come to the right hand side of this box and you can see the figure in here, which is changing all the time because Bitcoin's going up and down like a yo-yo at the moment. Um, but three little dots next door to this, if we click that where you can deposit uh, we can withdraw or we can trade. Well, of course, we wish to withdraw some. So we're going to click the withdraw button. This brings us up to this screen and Bitcoin withdrawal. And the important thing is here, this address. Now, if you remember, we had the address copied and pasted into this notepad. So if I highlight it, copy, Come to add addresses, place the Bitcoin withdrawal address in there and the description in here. Okay, Sincere Systems and I'm going to save the address. And now we have it in here. The amount. Now, of course, we've already copied the amount that we need and I'm going to pop that figure in there and review the withdrawal now there's a fee of course which is 0 0.00050 and so what uh, the withdrawal will be is uh, 0.1785 but I'd like to confirm the withdrawal of this amount of uh, actually of this amount plus the fee of 0 0.0050 um, into this address? The answer is yes. Now the actual answer to my own question, should I press the button, should have been no. And the reason is this. Kraken charge a fee to take out a certain amount of Bitcoin. The fee changes depending on the amount of Bitcoin. The fee isn't added to the amount that's taken out so that the amount that you withdraw is exactly what you want. The fee is taken off that amount. So what goes to the company or what goes to the wallet that you're sending it to is less than you want it to be. Now, at the time, I didn't realize this and uh, I clicked the button uh, thinking that everything would be fine. But unfortunately, this is where things go a little wrong. The amount of money that goes from my Bitcoin Kraken account to Sincere Systems was wrong. And because it's wrong, the whole computer system basically fails and lets you know that the amount is wrong and then just literally hangs. Let me take you through the next sequence. Now, the withdrawal has successfully been submitted and this is the um, basically the log. I can now view my withdrawals. And coming down to the bottom of the page, actually, let's just do this um, on Google and just check the time. 
So we're 4th of November at 1946. So let's just check back at this page, go down to the funding transactions, and we see that the uh, transaction is going through. And if we hover over here, it um, has been initiated. Now, for those of you who know about Bitcoin, you know that there's a certain um, amount of time needed for the Bitcoin to travel through the wonders of the internet to the, uh, <laughs> to the other account. Uh, we can cancel the withdrawal if we wish, but obviously we don't want to do that. And um, what we're going to do is to see how long it takes from um, this uh, time of 1946 on the 4th of November to actually get to our account. OK, here's something interesting um, that has happened. Um, we are and I'm just going to bring up the Google here. Um, we are at 1959 and what has happened is that we have the incorrect amount received now what the, what i think has happened here is that uh, kraken have taken this figure and have charged a fee and rather than add the fee on they've taken the fee off this figure so in fact sincere systems have um i think 0. 0.0005 less than they should have for for this so we've got a little bit of a problem on our hands so it says here please contact the supplier to resolve this issue so after that nightmare i got back to kraken and quite understandably they said i'm sorry once the bitcoin transaction has happened it's happened you can't take it back again the uh, amount has been sent to that address now luckily because we cut and pasted the address uh, we knew that it had got to Sincere Systems. It just wasn't the right amount. It was a little bit lower. Um, so the best thing um, really my sponsor said was to get on to support, which I did. Um, so I, I sent them this uh, little message uh, that I wanted to fund my account with 1500 to that address. Um, the amount was incorrect. It seemed that the fee of um, 0 0.005 Bitcoin was taken off. Um, and this resulted in a certain amount being sent. Um, the administrator here said, um, hello, please indicate the transaction hash. In the near future, the deposit will be credited to your personal account. Now, the hash code is the long number that is on blockchain, which is basically the, the center of Bitcoin transactions. And once you've got that number, then you can send that to Sincere Systems and they can find that in their back office. And I, I've got a separate video that explains how to find that hash number. I won't go through it now, um, but there is a uh, link in the description below and I'll try and put a link on this um, on this video as well, so you can just click on it if you wish to uh, to have a look. Um, anyway, we found the hash code, or I found the hash code, and it was this one. Um, the next message that came through was, uh, "Hello, your payment will be processed, and the amount we received will be credited." Um, I said, "Are you? Could you tell me when that's going to be done?" And the administrator said, uh, "Hello, thanks for waiting. The payment will be processed within a day." I found that it had been put into the system, so I sent back all in the system now, thank you. So, the final amount credited was $1,430. It went in on November the 10th, 2020, at 17.48 and 14 seconds, which was approximately six days later after my original transaction. An absolute nightmare. So I'm gonna leave you really with this one comment, and that is, if you are going to fund Bitcoin into Sincere Systems, which I highly recommend that you do, please please do it from a hard bitcoin wallet and not from a bitcoin exchange because it is really complicated to try and get the exact figure nothing wrong with the exchange if you're going to buy bitcoin on an exchange just withdraw it onto your hard wallet and then upload it into the sincere systems if you look at yesterday's video you see that happens in about three minutes it's really really quick i mean it suggests 20 but it's about three um, what I'm going to do on tomorrow's video is I'm going to fund a little bit more into the system using perfect money. Now, once again, this will be a live um, on the spot video. I've not ever done it. So it's going to you're going to really follow along with me and see whether there's any problems in doing it with perfect money. Um, 
thanks for watching the video today and I hope you've learned something and I hope it hasn't put you off um, joining Sincere Systems because the system itself is wonderful. It's just there's a little hiccup which you need to uh, be aware of more than anything else. Um, if you want to connect with me on Facebook, the link is below. If you want to join me in the system, the link is also below. And if you haven't seen the previous videos, um, I've got those in the description box as well. My name's Chris. Thanks very much for watching. I'll see you on the next video. Take care now. Bye-bye. Did you whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you whoa, whoa.